Growing up, my favorite film to watch was The Little Mermaid. There was something about the bright colors of the mermaids and the many fish in the sea that sparked an interest in me to draw. I would spend countless moments trying to draw Ariel and her fish friends and imagining a life under the sea. That's where my fascination for the ocean also developed and that led me to pursue my studies in marine science. I continued to nurture my artistic skills and my talents and learned more about the marine environment, keeping both my passions close at heart. Nowadays, when I head out for a paddle in Laudala Bay Suva, I still feel that same sense of wonder and fascination around being in the ocean. When I see rubbish while out at sea and all along the shoreline every day, I feel the need to do something about the marine problem. Bulubinaka, my name is Suzanne Thurangniwai. I'm a graphic designer, an avid paddler, and a marine advocate based here in Suva. I started Benuniwai 3, an artivism project which looks to highlight the impacts of plastic waste along the coast of Suva. Artivism to me is best described as activism through art. It uses the power of creative expression to create awareness, spark important conversations, fuels action for social issues affecting us in society today. In my free time, I head down to the seaside and collect any rubbish I find that washes up with the tide. I keep some of the rubbish to use in my art pieces that I arrange and share on my Instagram account. I started Benuni Waitui to merge my artistic talents with my love for the ocean. I'm the president of my paddling club. There is a great deal of water confidence built into paddlers from being in and around the ocean so often. And I think that's an important value to have as Pacific Islanders. As paddlers, we are often encouraged to care for our marine environment by collecting any rubbish we may find during training sessions and regattas. I began to notice the common and colorful items that washed up with the tides. Clothes bags, disposable lighters, plastic bottle tops, I would collect all the bags to take home to use. Then I thought, why don't I repurpose the other items as well? And that, my friends, is when Benu Niwai 3 started. I created an Instagram account where I post creative arrangements and pictures of the things I'd find on my walks. I also stumbled upon a large international online community of activists with the same idea too. People from all over the world collecting, upcycling and creating art from marine debris just like me. My hope is that this initiative encourages young people, creatives and all Fijians alike to get involved in whatever way they can to address the waste management issues we have in Fiji. Whether it's through adopting more eco-friendly lifestyle habits, sparking a talanoa around waste management in your family, in your community or in your schools, re-evaluating our consumer choices or even cleaning up your neighborhood. It all starts with that first step into action which eventually leads to collective community efforts to a cleaner and an eco-friendly Fiji. Vinaka.